tentative statistics available to us indicate that out of the about 560 students who sat for the exams, 91 of the students passed all the 10 courses, 172 of the students passed, failed one or two of the courses, and 295 of the students failed more than three courses and therefore have been repeated. Basically, the Independent Examination Board is telling us that 84% of students who sat for the bar exam in May and September are not qualified to be called to the bar, and this failure rate is unprecedented in the history of the Ghana School of Law since its inception in 1958. It is our position as an SRC that the circumstances surrounding the marking process call into question the integrity of the published results. We are convinced that the absence of transparency in the setup and the conduct of the exams, as well as the marking and its subsequent release, makes the results not a true reflection of the performance of the students of the Ghana School of Law. And accordingly, we totally reject the results as has been brought by the Independent Examination Board. Again, we are saying that in line with the rules of natural justice, a judge cannot be, or a person cannot be a judge in his own course, and therefore we are calling for a remarking of all the scripts of failed students. But most importantly, but most importantly, this remarking must not be done by the Independent Examination Board as allowing the same body whose conduct we are complaining against superintend over the remarking would amount to a breach of the rules of natural justice.